Good morning, everybody. Today we're playing Angel Arena and uh, more specifically Ember's Bird. But before we get into that, today's video is sponsored, brought to you by GameLeap.com. Link in the description. Feel free to check it out. We're going to talk about it in more detail a little bit later on. But for now, we're just going to be doing Ember's Bird. Now, Ember's Bird is completely overpowered and broken. Anything now, these are two separate Holy things. And I want I really want you to, to think of them as two separate things. Now, first of all, Ember's Bird is just really, really good because he's Ember's Bird. Just that alone might make him a little bit overpowered, right? He's like really, really good. But he's not like excessively overpowered. I don't really think he's an issue. Maybe a little bit, but really not too much. What is an issue, however, is that he is broken. As in... He is buggy. What is buggy about him? Slider Fist is supposed to deal bonus damage to heroes and only 50% damage to creeps. However, it doesn't work that way. Instead, what it does is it deals bonus damage to everything. The 50% penalty that you get usually with this ability because you're using it on creeps doesn't exist, not in Angel Arena. That is a serious issue, and that makes this hero completely ridiculous. That pushes him from, okay, he's maybe a little bit on the strong side, to, this is stupid, this is just dumb, right? This hero is just, this hero is just dumb. And, uh, yeah, so that's kind of the thing with, with Ember Spirit. That's why you're seeing a lot of Ember Spirit in Angel Arena right now. He's just a little bit, a little bit ridiculous uh, because of that bug. And that's really it. <laughs> Right, there's nothing else going on with the hero. There's no oh, other reason why he is super, super powerful. He's just, you know, regular Ember Spirit. But he's buggy. And and that is a bit of a concern. Right? Now, how do you deal with that? Well, you wait for them to fix it. That is really the con to play. This is not going to be in the game for very long. Uh, I personally wouldn't worry about it. I wouldn't worry about trying to figure out a fancy strategy to count it. But I wanted to show it off anyway. Just wanted to show off how stupid this can actually get. Because it does get very stupid. <laughs> oh man. Alright. Let me go ahead and uh, get myself my first Aquila. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and head over here now and just continue farming. Just continue farming. Now, our first item here is going to be a Battle Fury. Now, this is, of course, not really all that surprising. I mean, it is Angel Arena after all. But the thing is, the, this Battle Fury is actually insanely, insanely useful. Because with just a Battle Fury, we can immediately go and kill Ancient Creeps. And by kill them, I mean we push W on them once and the entire camp is dead. And that is a little bit broken. Right? Again, this hero is mildly mildly stupid right now and <laughs> and yeah so uh i'll try to show that to you today you know that's kind of the strategy here uh of course having this uh you know this this uh, burning ability allows us to farm these really early which is also quite powerful so he's just good in general right he's just he's just a really solid hero in general but yeah, anyway, I feel like that about sums it up. Now, let me go ahead and quickly tell you guys about Game Leap for a minute. What is Game Leap? Game Leap is a website where you can go to and they'll have guides on there. Now, these guides, and this is what makes Game Leap special, these guides are all up to date. They're all in a nice order, in a nice format. They are all following the same structure. They are all made by professional top tier players. And it's all in one place. And that's really what makes Game Leap worth it for you. Right? Like, that's what makes Game Leap worth it, in my opinion. They themselves... Okay, look. I was told... You know, I, I was kind of told, like, here you go. This is how you pitch the side. Right? This is how we always pitch it. This is what we think is the best thing about the side. And it is not the pitch I'm giving you right now. Right? They were like, oh, it's we have all of these top tier, like, AK MMR players making guides for us and such. And I don't give a shit. Right? I, I don't give a shit. I really don't. Right? Let me be honest with you. But what I do care about, and this is a really big deal to me, is that everything is in one place. Everything is right there. Right? People always say, well, why would I go to a website that I need... By the way, this is a paid service, right? But why would I need to pay for this if it's like all on the internet? It's like right there. It's for free. But the thing is, first of all, Game Leap doesn't have ads. So that's why it's for free, you know? Like, you're not actually... 
it's not actually free on <laughs> YouTube. No, you are the product. But um, that's an entirely different discussion. So uh, anyway, anyway, but yeah, uh, if you know a thought about it really properly, but uh, you are the product on YouTube. Your YouTube isn't free. It's just they are selling you. That's what they are doing. But on Game Leap, everything is right there. Everything is available in a nice and easy to find format. You don't have to go and search through a hundred thousand videos of a hundred thousand morons that you've never heard of and you're not really sure if the stuff is up to date and all of that crap. Nope. It's all up to date. It's all right there. And yeah. Hello. Uh, yeah, we're just going to fight this out. I'm going to finish you really quick like that. Why am I over here now? <laughs> Well, I know why, but it's a little bit odd. <laughs> uh, do you know what happened right there? Yeah, the Slide of Fist teleported me back into the arena after I killed him. Because I killed him with the Slide of Fist, you know, I finished him with that. And um, then the game was like, no, you're not going to be in the arena, not right now. And just teleported me over there. Which is like the base spot you go to. If the duel is done, but you're still in the arena. <laughs> so, it's kind of funny like that. But anyway, we almost got our Battle Fury. So yes, we're absolutely just straight up rushing this, right? You saw I'm, I'm not spending a lot of money on anything else. But yeah, anyway, to just quickly finish up the Game Leap thing, go on Game Leap, just go on the website and just take a look. That's all I ask of you. I don't ask you, I'm not asking you to sign up because you're an adult. You can make that decision yourself, all right? You can make your own fucking decisions. You don't need some asshole on the internet making them for you. But you can take a look. You can do that for me. All right? So anyhow. Uh, yeah. We're gonna go ahead and clean out this stuff now. We're super close to just winning the game. I know this sounds a bit stupid, but like, seriously, we need nothing, actually. We, we just need... Uh, no, that's, that's it. We're done. <laughs> I'm just gonna sell a mango. Gotta sell. Actually, no. I'm gonna sell the Iron Talent. I mean, at this point, we don't really need it anymore. And um, no, I have this. Uh, yeah, no, that is that is it. All right, there we go. We got the Battle Fury. Now, Battle Fury. Uh, seven minutes. In Angel Arena, that's fine. Usually, it's not that good. No, get out. I need experience too. All right. But anyway, so there's a bunch of creeps there. What we do is this. Rip. You see that? That is what makes this hero broken as fuck. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over here and do the same thing as well. Slide of Fist is completely broken because it doesn't have the penalty. The bonus damage, not that big of a deal. But the lack of the penalty is huge. <laughs> Look at that. It's just dead. It's just dead. It's just a dead camp. <laughs> and now we're level 11. We got the Slide of Fist. Uh, at, you know, almost maxed out. I'm gonna go and shackle them down. Now, another thing that actually makes this hero a little crazy in this mode is, um... Okay, let's go and get some damage in here. Is his other abilities are really good too, right? So I talked about this in the beginning, how you could kind of argue this hero is already a little overpowered, just, you know, without the bug. And that's because of a few reasons. few reasons here. Oh, we did. Alright, now what are those reasons? First of all, first of all, this right here always lasts two seconds. The duration is static, which it isn't usually. Right? Usually it starts out at one second. So you can only you can go ahead and just put one point into it and you got a huge value point. You don't need any more. That's super powerful. Right? Secondly, this right here starts at 400 magic absorbed, so it goes up to 2000. The damage isn't that high, but the damage reduction is insane. <laughs> <laughs> right, and that is just that is just stupid. Right, then this right here, Fire Emblem, you have six charges instead of three. No so all around, like all of his other stuff is also just just buffed, and then you have the the slide of fist thing going on. No ah, it just gets stupid. All right, it just gets fucking stupid. All right, we got a bit of a situation there, but that's fine. What? I should probably skill my ultimate sometime soon. Oh, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Alright, nice. Got him. Let me get my Sage and Yasha. What's the Sage and Yasha about? Sage and Yasha is just gonna upgrade our Battle Fury, right? And as you can see, I'm being aggressive. I'm, I'm going into their face. Our first few items here are gonna be the Sage and Yasha, and then just upgrading 
the Battle of Fury and our face boots. And that's just gonna make us stupidly powerful. There we go, kill this really quick. Yeah! <laughs> right, when I said, when I said Slide of Fist is broken, you didn't think it was gonna be this broken, right? You were like, oh yeah, I mean, clearly that is very powerful, but I mean, okay, how strong can that be? Well, very. Turns out very, very strong. Uh, we got him, so that's good. Oh shit, cool down. Alright, time to go. Time to go. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, we're out of mana, that's not good. Got a duel though? Uh, let's just pray this duel lasts long enough. Yeah, can you just make this duel last for a little while? I need to regen some mana. <laughs> just run. <laughs> Deafening Blast, okay. Interesting. I would just uh, Ice Path him, but that works. How come he's only got one point into everything? What's going on with that? Oh, okay. We actually did regen enough mana. Sick. Sick. <laughs> that worked out pretty well, I would argue. Yeah, I'm quite happy about this. Alright, now we're just gonna be aggressive, right? Like how you usually do it in Angel Arena, right? You get your you get your starting stuff that you need, and then you go in. You go in deep! You go wreck some force. Ah, oh, wrong button. Ah, it's fine. I got this other button that is like kind of exceptionally powerful, so it's gonna be alright. And uh, there are my face boots. Good old face boots. We're gonna go to max out the flame gun. Again, it is so, so strong. But the face boots are really scary. <laughs> like, we know that they end up dealing 250 bonus damage, which, as you might guess, is quite a bit. I'm actually not sure how much better they upgraded. I don't think this is worth it right now. Of course, you gotta upgrade it. Right, but I think right now going for the face boots is probably going to be a bit more effective. Alright, so we're level 15 now. We only need one point into the fire remnant. The charges don't increase. The only thing that changes is um, the, 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 the damage. Right, and this is an ability we never, ever, ever use for damage. So that really does not matter at all. Right. Go ahead and kill this really quick. As you can see... <laughs> <laughs> we have a little bit of money. We have quite a few kills too. Let's go ahead and upgrade our face boots. We need 6,000 gold for that. But of course, once we have those 6,000 gold... Oh, shit. God, that is irritating, man. Mana leak. Mana leak. But yeah, once we have our 6,000 gold, then we can just kind of uh, one-shot people. I mean... I mean, we seriously deal insane damage at that point. It's just, you hit for 250 extra damage with those, right? And that's quite a bit, as you might imagine. Other items that are really good. Well, actually, our item build here is going to be uh, the, the upgraded face boots, upgraded battle, uh, battle fury. And then I just like going for desolator. I actually really, really like the desolator. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello, my friend. Okay. Yeah, you're not gonna get through my flame guard. Like, not even close. Oh, okay. Well, this might be an issue. Well, we got one. Alright. Okay, just keep doing this. We are fine. <laughs> We are fine! <laughs> oh man. Not even all that close. Let's 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 keep it real, man. Let's keep it real. That wasn't even an issue. We're dropping a little low on HP, but that's that's okay, right? That's okay. So we almost have our upgraded face boots. Whew, that was a bit scary for a second, but really, it wasn't that close, right? Just a little bit. But as you can see, having six Fire Remnant charges is actually a little bit stupid as well. Dude, that's my creeps. That's my camp. I farmed that camp. I farmed that camp. You can have you can have this shit down there. I haven't farmed that a single time. I haven't been there at all, but I farmed those Ancients and these. And their face. Yeah, that's kind of what I do here. I like being aggressive. You know, it's just the, the next level of meta in this game mode. 
right? Being super fucking aggressive, shutting them down. Oh, I got him rooted. Oh. <laughs> oh, got him. Sorry, man. All right, so we got the upgraded face boots now. As you can see, we hit really, really, really hard. That's good news. Upgraded Desolator next. Oh, God, fuck. I always forget about that thing. All right, let's just go. Yeah, I still got my flame going out. Oh, shit. Didn't get it. Just about to use the slide of fist, but... All right. All right. I think right now we're going to go ahead and upgrade our... Actually, I'm not sure. So another item I really like is actually the Vladimir's. You know, just some good old Lystia, and we're going for Vladimir's because we'll upgrade into... Um, you know, we're going to get ourselves a Desolator, right? And so Vladimir's just makes the most sense since it's the only way we can have Lystia. The road is endless. Nothing else really works in that regard, obviously. <laughs> now, one thing that's really useful is actually putting down a remnant before the fight, before the um, duel. No oh, look at that. Oh, that was weird. Alright. Okay. So we just, like, teleport out, and then we can teleport back in. And it's a bit funny like that. Alright. Uh, yeah, we're gonna kill you really quick. I'm kind of running out of mana again. Goddamn mana leak. How dare you, man. Oh, come on. Come on, let's go. <laughs> oh, hello. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Alright, uh, we got the ultra kill. Easy peasy. Not even an issue. Time to retreat out, though, because we don't want to stay too long. Right, we don't want to... We don't want to randomly die. That's a bit unnecessary. All right, so we got that one, and I'm gonna get a Vladimir's now, right? Just the casual Vladimir's is super useful. And, uh, Angel's Desolators. Now, Angel's Desolators is really expensive. It's actually something I really like about this hero. There's a very reasonable item build you can do that is very powerful, transition spell with boss items, and uses exclusively money for the early game, right? And that's just, that is the perfect mixture, right? That is the dream right there. <laughs> oh, there's the, oh, no. I'm gonna take you really quick. I was actually going for that Luna, but that's all right. That's all right. Dropping a little bit low, but that's fine. Oh, God. You know what? I'm just gonna gonna leave. I don't like this ability. <laughs> Maybe I'll go for Diffusal Blade. Can you purge it off? I'm not sure, actually. Okay, we got him with that. Got him with that. I don't think we're getting him. He's a little bit tanky. <laughs> no, we'll be fine. We got a Remnant down. Golden Rule of Ember Spirit. Applies in this game, too. You always put down a Remnant. Alright, you always put down a Remnant. Keeps you safe. Makes it so that you're almost never going to get caught. The only time you should ever really get caught as an Ember Spirit is when you don't have a Remnant down, which is 100% your own fault. Could have prevented that. I mean, absolutely, you could have prevented that. Alright. Maybe I shouldn't have walked in on this. Thinking about it, that, that doesn't sound very smart. Alright, time to go. Man, I like can't really move. <laughs> I can't really move. Killed by neutral creeps. Oh, that's a little bit surprising. Wait, why are they all dying to neutrals? Are they doing a boss? Is that what they're trying? Oh, it's just a little bit odd. Well, I mean, why else would they all be dying to neutrals? That's a little bit odd. It's certainly not the Ancients, because I'm killing those. <laughs> the way is I'm taking that part of the map. <laughs> Alright. Like like Shit, let's these guys. It's like 100 HP after two camps. We got ourselves... Who's that scorching fellow? 4k left. Only 4k? God, the Ancients Desolator. Ancients Desolator, of course, just cuts through people, right? But anyway, I just wanted to make a video about this Ember Spirit before he gets nerfed. Because I just wanted to show you how ridiculous he is, right? And he's insane. It is so dumb. It is so dumb how powerful Slide of Fist is. 
the thing is, it shouldn't be this powerful, right? And by that, I mean, it literally should not be this powerful. <laughs> the game doesn't intend for it to be this way, but... Oh. Uh, ooh. Okay. No. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. And look at that. Look at ourselves, the angels desolated. Now we can really go and fuck some people up. And again, I'm not actually skilling more Fire Remnant. I really see no reason, no benefit. Yeah, it's just like... Wouldn't do anything. Ooh. Well, we dodged that. Still trying to kind of stay in this. Okay. Nice. Nice. Still alive. Base Ricky with the cloud. <laughs> Oh, rip, Luna. God damn, Mana League bullshit. Nope. Okay. Oh, the, the Rampage is... Shackle him. Oh, get him. Get him. <laughs> what is that? Like a times six, times seven Rampage? What the hell? All right. Oh, dude. What do we do? We take those. Absolutely, we take the way to go. Put down our little little friend over there in the background, just keeping it, you know, keeping it available to us. And we got a duel coming up in three, two, one. Please, yes, we're in there. I'm excited. I want to be in there. Okay, mm, that's a bit of a bit annoying, but oh, okay. So this is actually something I've seen quite a few people do. Um, to counter the Ember Spirit. What is the counter to Ember Spirit? Okay, everybody knows. Alright, that's how you counter the two scary spirits. Well, like the two... You know. Earth Spirit is scary too, but he is like the two core spirits. I don't know, Storm and Ember. Alright, okay, that's how you shut those fools down. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, base punch! Base punch, man! <laughs> Pulling me out of that one. Yeah, I, I don't think I would have survived it, honestly. <laughs> I had a little bit of a silly situation going on with the with the big guy. But hey, I mean, I'm not gonna complain about it. Not gonna complain about it. So what's the usual counter to Orchid? Right, Manta Star, that's what you do. If you're playing Ember Spirit, you buy yourself a Manta Star. Get yourself out of the Orchid. Works pretty nicely. It's quite powerful, as you might guess, but right now it doesn't really even seem that necessary. Because <laughs> you're just running these fools over, absolutely tearing them apart. That is because, ladies and gentlemen, I went on GameNeed.com, and trust me, that shit even works for Angel Arena. Although they don't have Angel Arena guides on there. I pro By the way, this is actually something I, I proposed to them, I'm just like, I'll write Angel Arena guys, I don't fucking care. I like. I am the literally best Angel Arena player in the world, which I'm not, but <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. Oh shit, also, that was a weird noise I just made. I'm okay with making weird noises occasionally. Because who doesn't? Who doesn't? Oh god, based Ricky. Oh hello. Alright, that's a bit awkward, can't really do anything right now. Alright. Oh man, the bashes! Wow! Wow! Alright! If you do that, then you'll kill me, I suppose. <laughs> I already have a counterplay for that situation. Well, that's fine. So we're gonna go ahead and get ourselves the sacred butterfly. Because we're sacred and we like butterflies or something. And good old Manta style. The Manta style! The stylish, stylish, the stylish. The most styly, stylish. Oh, I'm trying to be cool and hip with the kids again, and I just can't do it. I'm terrible at that. Oh, well, I should just accept my fate. I'm an old man. Okay, let's get these fellas really quick. But yeah, we got we got a man to stand now, so that's gonna deal with the the silence, of course, right? Don't really like that too much. We also level 42, which is awesome because. Having a lot of experience is actually quite useful. 
Right, I mean, you get a decent amount of stats from it. I need more time. I get... Oh, shit. Behold, my nope. Oh, he really got the right one. That is impressive, man. That is impressive. Alright, I'll take these guys down really quick, though. So at this point, the creeps can kind of tank it, but at this point, we are also supposed to to have, uh, you know, uh, what's it called? <laughs> um, uh, shit, man. I'm losing track of what I'm trying to say here. No, uh, I told you, I'm old. No, at this point, we're supposed to start looking at, at boss kills, right? If at all possible. So... Once you have boss items, especially a reverse, it's insanely powerful. Then that's just not really an issue anymore, but... Right now... I don't even know if we'll get there. Me and the Ricky are shutting them down good. <laughs> Funnily enough, it's really only me and the Ricky, right? Nobody else is here. But hey, I'm not, I'm not gonna complain about it. I'm not gonna complain about it. Only 15 kills to go? Nope. Nope. Actually, I got Manta Star now, so suck it. Yup. Oh no. Sorry, my friend. Got him too. <laughs> okay, can we get this? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. Well, we're just gonna be kind of stuck with him for a little while. That's fine. It's so hard to get through the Flame God, right? Like, the Flame God blocks 2000 damage. That's just a lot. That is just a lot of damage block, even for Angel Arena. So, yeah. Meepo got his Aghanims. <sighs> Alright, let's put this down. Oh! Well, one of them is done already. Go ahead and finish up the rest really quick, shall we? Yup! <laughs> Five to go. Five to go. Just run them over. Just run them over. No, thank you, good sir. Got a number one. Got a number one. <laughs> Free to go. And they can't really fight. Alright, it is so hard. It is so difficult. How do you go up against this? Oh, I'm sorry, man. And that's it. It's game right here. Boom. Rampage on the Meepo to end it all. Anyhow. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, good old Angel Arena, of course. Let me actually go and take a look at the score. 46 kills. 46 kills. Isn't that insane? Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Ember Spirit is broken. He is very likely going to be fixed soon. If he isn't, go abuse him while you can. <laughs> Although not in my games. He will be banned in my games. I just wanted to showcase him, but no more of this, right? There's a difference to me between something that is broken because, you know, the, the balance in the game is off and this is just clearly a bug. And this is just clearly not intended, so, nah. Anyway, please go check out GameLeap.com. Link down below, right? I'm not asking you to sign up, just asking you to take a look. I have videos on there too, like you saw my armor guide. Yes, I'm writing more videos for them like that, right? I actually, at this point, I have an overall of three finished yeah i think i, ha I made an arm on effective hp guide i made a video about um creeps and one about unreliable and reliable gold so that's all gonna be on there anyway hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll see you guys tomorrow goodbye